Welcome back to How to Google. This video is a brief tutorial on the Google Drive and the Google Docs platform and how to use that. Uh, so if you go to google.com backslash drive, it takes you here and it's basically the home page for the Google Drive. Uh, the drive, it gives you some of the examples of the features. You can store any file. Google gives you 15 gigabytes of space for free. Uh, the thing that they didn't mention here, though, is that any Google Doc you use, a Word Doc, well, it's not Microsoft Word, but it's a, um, a Word document, a spreadsheet, or a presentation that you use one of their platforms, it doesn't use your storage space. So the convenience of this is you can actually download this on your computer and your phone and then all your files are with you wherever you go. It's one of the cloud storage units. So this is the drive and this is what you need to get started using uh, the Google Docs. So here we will click on the go to Google Drive and this is actually looking at my current Google Drive. Uh, what is important to note here, though, is over here in the corner. You can see the Google Docs, Google Sheets, and Google Slides, and then Google Forms, Google Drawings, and Google My Maps. So these are all Google documents, and these all don't count towards the 15 gigabytes of space that Google gives you. So the first thing you want to do with Google Drive is basically get it organized so you can see I've got my different um, companies kind of organized by subfolder and each one of these can be shared separately so you can see here my financial statements Let's see if we can expand that so you can see my financial Slain LLC financials are actually shared with someone this is what this folder indicates here while most of the other stuff is not one of my older companies, Ninja Property, was or is shared with uh, previous partners. Uh, then we've got my personal documents here as well, uh, as well as the shared with me folder. So this is when someone else shares information with me. Uh, the recents tab is handy. It actually shows you which of the Google, which of the items in the Google Drive you recently pulled up. The starred, you can star things, so it's kind of like your most used if you want to take a look at those more quickly or you need to go back and reference them. Uh, and then the trash, That's this is something important to remember too. All your documents are stored in the trash bin until you empty it, and once you empty the trash, they are no longer available. Uh, and it does give you a warning here, so we're going to empty the trash. A handy feature of the Google Drive, and I'm operating on a Mac, is that you can install the Google Drive on your computer. So now all of this information in the Google Drive is automatically synced with my computer uh, as well. So your documents are available directly on your Mac or PC as well as online. They're also available through the Drive app on your mobile device. So that's my brief tutorial on the Google Drive. We will get into the Google Docs, Google Sheets, and Google Presentations in other videos. Please click subscribe, and thanks for watching.